performance motorcycle fans with big displacement bikes like the ZX14 or the Hayabusa may be surprised to learn how much interest and technology there is in small bore machines like this heavily modified Honda PCX175 scooter. And in fact, in terms of motorcycle drag racing, on Cycle Drag, we noticed the individuals over in Thailand and other countries love to drag these bikes. Well, we met Troy, who was out on a ride from San Diego to Laguna Beach and showed us some of the technology in use as he pulled out his laptop and made some tuning changes. He said this motorcycle is a lot of fun and keeps him safe. All right, here we are with Troy all the way from San Diego. We're in Laguna Beach. We're quite a far away from home. I had to stop because I feel like I'm at the drag races. You're putting a tune in the scooter. Tell me about this. Uh, we're going to put a brand new map in. We're going to go out and ride it and do a new self-mapping and then um, reload it back in there and test it and see if, if that's what I want. Okay. What type of system is this? Uh, this is a Pizzazz okay. for a Honda PCX. off and go play. You're particular about how you like your uh, machine runner. This is a uh, this is my little toy. Well that's awesome. That's, that's why I just saw yeah. I love the leathers too. Great set of bands and leathers. Here's the biggest question though. Why a small scooter? Uh, I've had them all. This just keeps me under 100 miles an hour. <laughs> okay. So it keeps you safe. Keeps you a little out little out of trouble. Uh, but this is like a big toy. You can constantly change and play and I guarantee you uh, if I'm in a group of Harleys, everybody will come to me first before the Harleys. How about that? Because it's different and, you know, the uniqueness of it. What do you think of the Groms and the other small bikes? Uh, I ride with them all the time. Okay. Different, different, altogether different kind of bike. Very cool. Uh, this bike uh, is real popular in Thailand. Really? It's I a, it's that. a uh, drag bike. Yeah, they drag races yeah. in Thailand. Look, look this Honda PCX Thailand and you want to see some tricked out, that's what to look at. That is amazing that yeah. you can make drag bikes out of this. What year is this? Uh, 2013. 2013. Uh, My goodness. Uh, yeah. Well, it sounds like you're going to have a faster ride home with these tuning changes. Uh, hopefully. <laughs> you know, safe ride. Yeah, be safe. That's number one. Thanks a lot for showing no us. No I appreciate it. That was one. cool. Absolutely. Let's take a look, second look here at this. As you can tell, everybody's got their preference. He's tuning in the scooter. He's going to take it home. He's going to take it all the way back to San Diego. We're about probably a good hour and a half from San Diego, right? Uh, yeah, probably. Because I'm just going to take the cars and then get on uh, at Dana Point. Have you ever done any drag racing? Uh, I might do it in two weeks. Where we at? we got a uh, Corona. we got a big scooter event. In Corona? Uh, Corona. Corona drag strip. Okay. Uh, it's... Uh, right in Ramona. Ramona. Yeah, yes. Ramona, but it's in Verona. It's just right, like 10 minutes from it. When is that event? Uh, the 7th and 8th. 7th and 8th. Of September. Uh, Saturday is the ride, and Sunday is all day drag racing, big thing. They, they shut the place, and it's strictly all scooters. Perfect. Um, well, thank you for telling me about this and showing me this. I'm interested because what I'm going to put this on right now is my site called Cycle Drag. It's oh, okay. Cycle Drag on YouTube. CycleDrag.com on Facebook, but what I noticed is I get a lot of traffic from Thailand with guys coming over on bikes just like this. Okay. So it's wild to see we're racing Hayabusa's and ZX14's and stuff, but some people have fun racing these things. Oh yeah, that's a whole different breed. Pretty cool, man. Oh, man. Thanks for showing okay. me. Love it. Good. Ride Let's safe. Go. What are your thoughts on, on this scooter? Would you ever drag race one of these things? Leave us your thoughts and also let us know where you're watching from in the comments, especially what country. If we have any of our friends from Thailand, let us know what the scene is like over there. That may be a cycle drag bucket list item to get over to Thailand and watch one of these drag bike races that take place on streets and alleyways. Speaking of streets, let's watch this gentleman take off.
That was great meeting and talking to Troy. He's on his way back to San Diego. It was a cool bike, but that just shows you in this two world sport that we love, there is so many different niche categories. It doesn't all have to be big bore bikes. Some individuals really like the small bore bikes. There's appeal to that. There's a big audience for that. We saw how popular the Honda Grom became. It truly is interesting. Let us know what you think. And above all, make sure you subscribe to Cycle Drag on YouTube. Make sure you like CycleDrag.com on Facebook for much, much more. Maybe even here from beautiful Laguna Beach. How great is this place? Thanks again to Troy. And guys, make sure you subscribe to Cycle Drag on YouTube and leave us your thoughts on this wild bike. Would you own one? Would you own this scooter? I want to know, yes or no. Thanks so much.